it. No gunshots, but they get in low, 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 low. Hello everyone and welcome, this is Revamp Gaming and today's video is going to be about a speculated 1.18 Halloween DLC update and if there was to be a Halloween update, the wish list and things that I wish to see in that DLC. Now, Rockstar had not confirmed a Halloween DLC as of yet and it, some people are saying that it's very unlikely we will get a Halloween DLC as we have already had a DLC this month for the LTS update. But then again, Rockstar are good with these uh, kind of ho uh, holiday updates. Uh, there was the Christmas update, and we're hoping that there's going to be a Halloween update. So guys, without any more said, let's get into the video. So we're going to start off with clothing for this DLC wish list, and I would love to see some sort of uh, costumes that you can wear. Maybe some kind of Dracula costumes, um, and I don't know really, maybe you could dress up as a mummy, uh, if they could make the textures or maybe make a costume for that, I don't know. Maybe you could get some kind of masks as well to go with it, so I don't know, maybe you could get some kind of Dracula bat ears as a type of mask, or maybe you could dress up as um, a wolf, get like a furry costume with the, uh, a mask from the mask stand down at Vespucci Beach um, to go with the costume. So we obviously we're thinking kind of obviously it's the Halloween update, so it's Halloween costumes. And I've heard people saying on other videos they want superhero costumes. I don't really see where this fits in with this DLC, but definitely costumes is a big one. And maybe you could get like a pumpkin kind of mask or head uh, to wear around within Grand Theft Auto V Online, which I think would be really really cool. It just it'd be a great feature to the game. Maybe it could light up, it might glow, or maybe it just could be a normal unlit pumpkin but anyway guys that is it for the costumes next we can go on to the weapons now weapons is probably the best category for this dlc as there are lots of possibilities you can do with it so the first one i'm obviously thinking is a michael myers type axe um if you what play call of duty ghosts on the map fod then you'll know exactly what the michael myers uh, costume mask and axe look like so you could go with a costume for michael myers but i think the axe would be a lot better um i don't know how rockstar would implement it for interaction with killing people but i just think it'd like be a really good uh really good weapon uh next you could have things like um baseball bats with nails maybe some freddy krueger type claws with blades on them um, maybe a chainsaw, I don't know, I know a chainsaw has been wanted for a long time within Grand Theft Auto V, so maybe we could see the possibility of having a chainsaw within this DLC, if there is one. Um, there, there's loads of other weapons, guys, I can't, I can't name them all, maybe, there's things like flamethrowers we could get, um, another good idea that I've seen around on YouTube is, uh, a blundergats type weapon from Black Ops 2 Zombies, that would be a pretty good, uh, type of weapon to have, um, but there's lots of possibilities of weapons, guys, and may I don't know, maybe you could have, like, pumpkin bombs from, like, if you've seen Spider-Man. Uh, sorry, I'm referring to a lot of different things, guys, but Spider-Man's probably the best example of this. If you've seen the Green Goblin, he has, like, pumpkin bombs. Maybe you could have, like, little bombs with the faces on them that glow as well. So that'd be really cool. It's just these small features that they add in DLC that make the game complete and worth playing again. So, next thing we're going to be on to is cars. Now I'm not really sure how we could or how we could or what type of cards you could add with a Halloween effect. Um, maybe you could add something like a coffin car or something like that. I don't know, guys, because a coffin car does seem kind of far fetched in terms of how you would put wheels on it, how you would sit in it and open the doors. I don't know. Um, maybe you could get a, a type of a new type of hearse that's all spooky and glows like the space docker from single player. I don't know guys, this is just a quick kind of summary with what I would kind of want to see within the uh, the update. Also, maybe you could uh, decorate the interior of your apartments, maybe put some decorations up, some spooky ghosts, stick things on windows, I'm not sure. Uh, you could put some, maybe Rockstar might could implement uh, spiders like of their own kind of nature, like NPC animals, but spiders that just like crawl around the floor or cobwebs in the corners of the room it's just these these small little features guys that make grand theft auto good and it that they are noticeable and actually f make you think how much detail rockstar have put into this game um so i don't know guys maybe you could get some kind of spooky bedding as well i'm not sure maybe uh, you could get some glowing lights i don't know guys it's hard to think because 
not many ideas have been generated for this kind of type of DLC yet, and it, it is hard to think of them, and also it is actually quite hard to implement them into the game, so Rockstar would have to take quite a while to do this but guys anyway i hope you did like the video this is revamp gaming if you want to go and follow me down on facebook and twitter then go ahead and do so them links will be down in the description so go and check them out all the videos and all the links i post will be there automatically so that's the best place to keep up to date with all my content also guys please if you did like the video leave a thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button as it does motivate me to make more grand theft auto 5 content and it shows your support so guys without any more said this is revamp gaming adios